So welcome back everyone. We are now starting our recording, our session today. This is our agenda for you to know that something important here today would be the um, theory. In some seconds, I will present you the goal, I mean the objective and the goal of the lesson. The goal is more like a uh, general activity and a constitution of, uh, let's say, a result, but the objective is more like instructional about the class. The students will be able to, okay. First, we will have a quiz online in this moment about theory because last time we didn't have the time to do it. But don't worry, it's not a great, don't stress. And it's a matter of you, the chat and the microphones. So I see who's participating. Then I will check the attendance. I will give you some minutes to take a, a look at some images, you will be speaking, I will be quiet. And then maybe two or three groups will present their teaching activities. Remember, it's an activity that is constructive and we are more than flexible, but you need to follow the instruction in virtual UGC. The Moodle is instruction I can show you in some minutes. So you will see, ah, this is good. Ah, I lost, I already lost the 20%, but I can still present my teaching activity. I know three or four groups are super ready today. So let's see. This recording will finish at 10, more or less. So the rest of the class will be you for producing, commenting on the forums, and maybe the most important, staying offline out of the recording so I can give you the feedback about the, for example, if you want to know the grades about the diagram of Venn, or if you want to know today the some of the grades about the teaching activity mm -hmm. but in total we have four instances of evaluation mm -hmm. there it is i'm going to put that just for some seconds and we start with the quiz okay remember the quiz about knowledge that is about activating what you know what you want to know is not a perfect answer there is a right answer but you don't, you don't need to be perfect you don't need to know what i'm going to ask you so it's like a kind of the deductive activity most of the time Teachers do it inductively. This is the content, this is the practice, then we have some quiz. Now today I want to do it the other way back. I'm gonna start with the quiz, new information, you start processing and you start thinking about the test online next week and the final exam in two weeks. And that's it. This is the midterm checkpoint, RCL is the call. Tell me questions so far about these dates. We can retake this slide later because we need to start with the agenda. But remember, four instances of evaluation. Number two is done, because that was last week, Venn's diagram. But the teaching activity, you see, there is an advance. For sending the advance. And the rest is the oral presentation in class or on a video. But I, I need to present your faces here in this Teacher. session. Yes, speak, speak. The moment to speak before the quiz. The so I, I think I yeah. think yeah. that we have one grade before to go to quarantena. It was two question about I don't I don't I forgot, but I mean I think it's the first it's the first grade. Oh, I don't know. No, but it well, was, that, that was a homework. That was a homework that you made on the the forum later. Ah, okay. If you want, okay. I can give you. For the forum, so wait, so, so noisy some of you. For the people who participate a lot in the forum, I'm going to give some points in the final exam. Person, please mute yourselves. I don't know who has the chat or who's playing games. In the middle yeah, of the class. <laughs> I don't know. Monica, maybe. Mm -hmm. Laura, well, <laughs> yes, you're in class, guys. So. Uh, yes, Camila, so what is the problem? I just have to send you, the, if you want to know the grade, at the end of the recording, I will give you the grade of the Venn diagram. I will present some examples later here in this moment. But yes, it was last class, April 14. Camila, I don't know what your question is. If it is in the system, it is in the system. That is the evidence, the virtual UGC, the platform. So friends, no more questions, can we get started? Please. Okay, it's time for you to, I'm going to unmute you. 
Maybe Karen is going to say something, no? What? So I will present you the quiz. We will have only five questions in this moment. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. So if you speak, that will be the first moment to check your attendance. If you don't speak, hmm, how do I know that you're alive? Where okay. is this quiz, three. teacher? Tell me? Where is the, qui the quiz, I mean, in the Moodle or something? I'm presenting you. In a second, okay. in a second, I am okay. presenting you. So this is the one. Ah, oh, wait a minute. There it is. We have five questions. Please use the chat. I am seeing here the chat. Or also. Okay. Camila Herrera, we can talk about the grades at the end, but the instructions are clear. If you have a grade and you didn't find a solution before, hmm? I don't know. Well, in the first question, please answer. I want to hear your voices. Don't say, who's good for you? No, just speak. Come on, answer. I listen to you and then I push on the right answer. Quickly. Show me. Now it's sensation. The person who wrote in the chat is for the public chat, not in the private. Mm -hmm. mm. Sense, sensation. Sensation. What does Next it mean, step. teacher? Later, we will explain this. Okay, please. This term refers to change in behavior potentiality. Which one? Answers in the chat, please. But I can see the answer. The, the Ah, this is an example of the exam. Some questions are A, B, C. Some questions are open. So somebody to behaviorism. Let's write the word behaviorist. Am I writing the spelling? Or behaviorism? Behaviorism. Let's see. Let's see. Maybe there is a connection. Changes in the conduct. Ah, look, Puh, learning. Mm -hmm. Come second, please. The feedback. Please, one volunteer. Microphones. Mm. This time. Que no sea que lo llaman y ahí sí participa, sino hable, por favor, people. Aristotle, por la organización. You're smart enough, you have your cell phone, don't you go to Google, Google, maybe? Muy bien, ahora no puedo hacer. No, Clayder, your microphone is open, but I don't know who else is there. Answer, put it. No idea? You have never heard about Aristotle's Four Laws of Association? Learning memory? Memory? Yes, recall. Recall means for that. To remember, to recall. It's a synonym. Yes. Nice. Record, remember, memory. First, the first time that you see this information, don't, this is not a great. Okay, four. Let's see. Mm -hmm, I remember this. Somebody is like in a different language, maybe, or in. If you know the word in Spanish, maybe, but put it, put something on the chat, guys. So passive. I don't want to be this active, the teacher and students only listening. 
because this will have a result. I will speak today like 10 minutes, but the rest of the class is your time speaking on camera if you want to have a great. So no? Somebody knows about John Locke? Award something? Mm -hmm. This is tabula rasa. Have you ever heard about it? Yes, Isabel, tabula rasa. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe I will have the class only with Isabel and Clay, maybe. Because those are the only two people like activating. Mm -hmm. Who else? Who else? Los que siguen escribiendo en el chat privado es en el público, porque si no, no van a ver las respuestas. Please. So, the class goes to Clay Derman Cohen, Isabel, and the rest of you? Okay, let's go on the last one. New vocabulary. Please put the letter A, B, C, D on the chat, please. What do you think? This is a prediction. You don't need, I am not testing you. Hmm? Love of a fat. This is what he says. Mm -hmm, don't worry. Law of readiness. 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 That's B. For the rest of you, the answer is B. New concepts here. Readiness. Laws. John Locke. Aristotle's four laws of association. Learning, referring to changes in the behavior. And habituation different to sensitization those are a lot of new words don't worry you can go to the link and find the, the quiz in total there are 25 questions what i'm going to do this is that i am going to have a, a, a group speaking about their activity and later we will continue in groups questions six seven eight nine and ten so i will create five groups that is later in this moment Friends, who's the first, let's say, volunteer, not to say victim, not volunteer, to say something about the teaching activity, to say something about what you plan, what you send me. Maybe I didn't send you a feedback as such, but maybe you are feeling that you are like ready. Maybe, Isabel, I know you have like a very big advance on your work. I'm waiting for people to speak. This is my information for today. I'm just sending you a lot of information here, but we will stop. I will check the attendance by asking you to read, asking you to read. Maybe you can give some comments, but this is the information I have to present today. Mm -hmm. This is very important because this is one of the questions or some of the questions for the online test, it's individually, is next class, is 10% of your grade, is one of the four evaluations. So you will have to recognize this, six, what it means each one, at least, what is the main idea, because this is like a, a review of what we have done so far in the course. So those are concepts you need to know, like behaviorist, keywords. I'm going to ask you for this in the exam. It's an online test. Let's not call it exam. It's only a test online in Moodle. Please, let's be honest about that test because if I gave you, let's say, if I give you one hour and you do it in two minutes, the system shows me. Isabel took it in five minutes when you are supposed to take it in one hour, for example, and you can take two attempts. And it's very easy because in the group, maybe you can say, 1B, mm, but the system changes the question. So it's not always 1B, 2C, okay? But maybe if you have the answer and you have all the materials, the importance of the quiz, sorry, about the test 
Is one the correct answer? And number two, justify some answers. And it's kind of easy, but try to do it consciously, dedicate the approximate you dedicate one hour in front of the computer or the cell phone and you work on that individually. Like you okay, well, okay, you have two chances to take the exam, but not three. And it's kind of similar to Crushing's quiz. Do you remember that I gave you in the week number seven some examples like Crushing? In this online test, I'm going to give you some points for those people who participated in Crushing's test. It's quite similar, okay? It's a little bit more extensive, but it's like that. True, false. Multiple choice, A, B, C, etc. Questions so far? Important concepts. Last time we were talking about the changes in the behavior due to the environment. And of course, it produces learning, which is changes in the knowledge and the behavior. Can be by means of the knowledge and by means of behavior. And we will see how they are interconnected or not. Some seconds, you read this info? Please let me know. Isabel is speaking today. Can I open the email you send me so I can see you like an advance? Or maybe, I don't know who. Lady, I saw you started a good job on planning. Okay, well, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand. I mean, are you going to show our video or something? Or you just want us to talk about our activity? No, no, if you allow me, I can present your video. That is the idea. Oh, okay. Well, it's like a presentation. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, if Carolina agrees too, for sure. Yeah, I agree. So we will do something. Um, you click on the video, you present it, ya les dejo compartir pantalla, but you speak, so the video has no sound, but you speak, and the video is the background, is the images, is it clear? Oh, okay. okay. Well, is that the video is kind of a presentation, so it's like we are both together in the, talking about what we want to do, and that's it, so mm -hmm. it's like a, like a powerpoint and we are talking so if you want we can present only the powerpoint and that's it yes and you go speaking on that okay let's finish okay. with this and okay. you can start sharing your screen you can start sharing your screen please friends i'm going to ask you yes what the name what's the name of his theory about lev vygotsky the russian guy i told you about and maybe he was the father of constructivism, I told you. But his theory has a, had, a, had a different name. Somebody, please, can help us? Lady, well, we can wait for your partner, but I know you are doing well, so you are advancing. If it is not to the presentation, at the end of the class, I can talk to Lady if your classmate doesn't arrive, and I can give you like, the feedback about that. Okay, Lady, I hope you're listening to me. And in this moment, let's be sure. What is the word? What is the name of his theory? Social constructive. No, no social, cult was, social cultural. Theory. Social interaction. Yes. Social interaction. Shonism. That is Vygotsky. Clear for everyone? Now, two concepts that I mentioned that I would like to explore later. Now, you know, I saw some of the diagrams, Ben's diagram, that you included this. So, two key letters or concepts. One is going to be the MKO, and the other one is going to be the ZPD. We are going to explore on that later. That is refer about some devices, CPD. And the last thing I can tell you is that his model had the name of the sociocultural model. Is the model sociocultural, but the name of the theory is 
social interactionism. Of course, he is in the frame of constructivism. Remember, in this week, week nine, we are working about constructivism and social theories. Last quotation: Let the God is the father of constructivism, but his theory is not called constructivism, but social interactionism. Social constructivism corresponds to our other friend, whose name is, do you know? Jean, Jean Piaget. 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 Ah, Piaget. So, Isabella, your group. I'm going to give you some minutes. Maybe I can deactivate my camera and I will appear again by telling you, you have one minute, two minutes, and you stop. But as for the rest, no interruption. The rest of the class, please use the chat, ask questions, make comments. No, girls, change this, or yeah, girls, you're doing a good job, or say something. After this intervention, I'm going to check the attendance. Okay? Teacher. Yes, questions before they start. Speak. Uh, we, we send you uh, a video. It a, it's a video, but just speaking with images, but we, that we don't I, appear. Uh, well, maybe in this moment I can present it. Let's see the time, let's see the time. Okay. Very fast. And what I can do is that I present the video, but you just at the end open the camera so I can ask you one or two questions. That's it. Oh, we can to be uh, so to clarify if anybody has a question or the not yes. so clear. The important in this activity because it's oral presentation is that I see you on camera. Maybe at the end you say, okay, any questions about our work or last comment, yeah. conclusion? Okay, teacher. Okay. Before we start, wait a minute, something in the agenda for everybody to have it clear. We are talking about, ah, oh, wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Goal, basically, today, to prepare an oral presentation, but no, you know, that is the way, to prepare a teaching activity. Please, everybody, open your Moodle. We are going to use it it's open simultaneously on your cell phone, or I don't know where. Open the virtual UGC because I need to show you something. So the main goal is divided into, the main objective is divided into goals. To prepare a teaching activity, only an activity or a class, it's up to the group, I wanted to see the interpretation of that. To prepare a teaching activity in the light of the memory and Piaget's theory. Am I right? Am I wrong? Am I lost? Maybe, Isabel, is it something that you prepare? You don't have to have the final product, but is it more or less what I told you or different? Okay, Laura Martin says that I am, a, I am. Yes, memory and the stages of Piaget. That was the explanation of the activity. Okay. So. Okay, well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I want to see something in the. This is done. Um, we are working in these teaching activities in this moment. Some examples, some explanations. So the last moment for this would be. And, ah, okay, look. Los que me enviaron, si ya no me enviaron, no, porque la instrucción era clara. No me envían ya avances, o no sea, se arriesgan a presentar. In this case, for example, Okay. There was a problem with the other device. Give me a second, please. But Isabel, you can start sharing the answer. Sharing the screen, sorry. So you can present your advance or whatever. Isa, are you listening? And you can start. Say whatever you have to say.
Okay. So well. Please start, ladies. So, okay, our memory activity is, well, yeah. Sorry. No problem, take your time. Okay, sorry, I was talking alone. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> well, this is our objective and basically as well as we can see here students from uh we were thinking of kid well teenagers of 15 and 16 years old can do this i mean it's not that complex but you would need to know some things and it's basically just like students will be able to identify categorize vocabulary related to trips and well in order to produce complete sentences with me. I mean, this activity is not only for living just using words, but also to use it. And uh, I mean, the, the outcome is a text that they are going to write in the, at the end of the class. And well, the activity basically, sorry, is that students will be sitting in a round and each one will say something like, uh, I will go to a trip and I will take and they will say a word and the next person needs to say a new word and remember the last one and that is that is how it is going to work and well basically that's it. Carolina? So yeah the role of the memory here is like in this type of, act of activity we may use of the echoic memory which is throw auditory stimuli which allows like attach words to a familiar topic like the trip and also involves repetition because you have to repeat the before the word that the last person said and with this activity we get vocabulary and remember or recall things like easier and also like improves the short and long term memory because like you can like store large larger quantities of information well by repetition and that and as isabel say it's not like produce words it's also like produce meaning like get the meaning and like comprehend and understand the message so that's basically and the uh, activity. The also is uh, we were thinking that it's uh, implicit, no, uh, explicit. Sorry. Explicit, because you're consciously repeating and learning new concepts. Mm -hmm. And yeah, basically, is that. I mean, that's what we were thinking to do. And uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's all. Mm hmm. Okay, friends, I have two questions. And at the end of the class, like at 10, 5, everybody disconnects and I stay only with you for the grade and the feedback, okay? Okay. Make okay. sure that I do it. Girls, please, first question. Why I don't see you on the camera? Oh, sorry. Is that? No, it's okay. It's okay. I'm just asking. Maybe in English class, I put the instruction like it's mandatory, obligatory to appear that you are gesticulating. But in this case, it's just a practical question. Maybe I, okay. eventually I will see, maybe at the end, in the, at the end of the class, in the feedback, I can see your camera so I can talk to you like in a yeah. classroom. Okay, for next okay. time, open your cameras, girls. If you cannot do it in this moment, open your cameras. But now the two questions are like this. Okay? Number one. What is the space or what is the stage, the period, the stadium that Piaget mentioned for your population? Because if you show me the first slide, you're telling the, the students will be able, but I understand, and the activity was clear. Okay? But 
according to the population, Piaget which stage, and according to that stage, the person or the boy is able to do this, can do this, or can do this. Yes, you mentioned something about Piaget? What is the stage? Okay, yeah, we didn't think about it. No? But yeah. yeah. Don't we worry. need to correct that. Oh, we are going to do this. Don't worry, don't worry. But you are going to do this. Now that we have the presentation, I can go I am going to ask you to create a very easy document. Yes? A document, a PDF document, with this information of your theory, of your presentation. Okay. Like yeah. a to create a lesson plan but only like a short summary of what you did in the presentation you include the part of Piaget and when I receive this I will validate your grade in the system in the Excel is it clear okay yeah yeah we have it but we don't we didn't share it okay. as product the final product is like a PDF document with images or text in which you tell me look this is the activity okay of course, you mentioned the theory of Piaget. Very good, you explain implicit and explicit memory. But for the rest of the groups, you have to speak about memory. Yes, very good. There's questions for the other groups. Remember, your feedback is at the end. Okay, yeah. Thank you so much. You can stop sharing the screen. How? I don't know how. Let me see. Oh, I don't know. No, Rita, al final del chat. De compartir, dejar compartir. Ah. Yep. I don't see ah, it. Okay, good. Sorry. No, don't worry. Okay. I think it's for you. Mm -hmm. For making some groups, I'm going to ask you to work in groups. If for those groups, I, my friend, what is the um, problem here? I was going to show you some examples of diagrams. Mm, but the problem is that the platform is not working in this moment. So I cannot see your diagram in this moment. I already saw that most of you gave it to me on time. Yes, good job. But I just need to make sure. Yes. That you can use this information in the coming presentations. I show you what information you need, and this is the way that I'm going to check attendance with the application of the university. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. It's a lot of information. Okay, I told you that this is part of the key concepts for the exam, for the test. Jean Piaget, Leo Vygotsky, and those are the characteristics for a constructivist uh, teaching style. Number one, it is related to problem solving. You know what I'm talking about. And you talk about this theory of problem based learning, problem based teaching, and hands on experimentation. Basically, Piaget said that. You are the protagonist of your own learning. Of course, there are influences, but you are the one responsible and you are an active learner, hands on. Then one, concept development. I started explaining something about the meaning, okay? How the constructivists create the meaning by means of observing and by means of interacting in the society. And I explained something about the meaning and the semantical fields, semant campus semanticals. It refers to how you construct, if I tell you pets, pets in Colombia, the system is different than pets in India and pets maybe in Australia. So that semantic field depends on your environment. And there is a logical reason, this is why we say that of course he is in the cognitivism uh, current, and this is the main characteristics of a constructivism model. Let's see how you, in your teaching activities, planning, you include some of these concepts. You see? It's not like too much theory, but the few concepts that you use, let's try to apply them in the presentations. So, can we make groups? What do you think? Or should we leave? Maybe next week, what do you think? No, the groups are going to be done in this moment. Mm -hmm.
Some seconds for questions or comments, please. I'm activating your microphone in this moment. Speak, say something. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to divide you in groups for the rest of the quiz. But before this, you can take a picture of the picture. This is also in the test, in the online test, that you may and you can differentiate mainly between, okay, those are behaviorists, those are the cognitivists, more or less. Well, 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 well. Profe, can we select our group? Yes, speak. No. Okay. Do it, sorry. Mm -hmm. Sure, the group is for what to do what to answer one question. I'm going to show you the oh, questions okay. first and then I make the groups. Okay, Mm -hmm. Please take notes because I, I don't, I don't want to repeat the info. Like, I don't know what in the chat, maybe Isabel, you can help me just writing this so you can write. Group number one is going to have question. Ah, look, look, the platform is not working, so I cannot show you the, the diagram of Venn. I wanted to have the best examples, but look, it's not working, so let's be patient. We don't need it in this moment, well, but I wanted to show the theories. So this is question number six. Mm -hmm. Question number six. So group number one. Cuando le toca el grupo uno, pues van a ser entonces. Question number six, okay? Number two. Question number seven. Si le tocó en el grupo dos, question number seven. Number three. Question number eight. And question number four. Yes, I'm going to create only four groups in this moment. If you are in group number three, I can show you the question. Six, seven, eight, and ten. Enjoy your groups, speak, use the chat. I will be in the groups eventually. Please participate. Teacher, you will assign the groups? I didn't understand. Yes, yeah, you are in the groups in this moment. I am activating. Hi. Hola. ¿Qué grupo somos? ¿Qué grupo somos? Sí. <risa> Cuatro. Entonces. ¿Dónde dice? Arriba te dice participantes en la reunión grupo pequeño cuatro. Sí, pero porque somos oh. cuatro. Pero ahí dice sesión de grupo pequeño tres. Ajá, tres. Somos el tres. Ah, entonces, ¿y cuál era el tres? Se <risa> el ocho. Sí. ¿Sí? Que decía el 8. Sí, creo que era, no. creo que era la, la pregunta 8. Pero yo no tomé nota. Pero lo Ay. Ya yeah. me está diciendo que interese a una reunión, no sé. Pero pues el profesor no nos mandó el link de eso. No. Algo así de ese quiz. Uh -uh. No, 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 no. Camila, cometí un error. <risa> ¿Cuál error? Me corté el pelo. <risa> ¿Ustedes dos enviaron el, el diagrama? Sí, bueno, yo no lo envié, lo envió Carolina. Y ella lo envió con el sí, nombre de todas. Sí, pero exacto. Ah, okay. No, yo me preocupé porque yo dije, huepo, chicas, a mí se me olvidó enviarlo. <risa> sí, la Camila, pero ¿dónde miramos esa pregunta? No sé por 
Porque es que él dijo que como que tomé nota, pero pasaba rápido y no sabía en qué grupo estaba. Pero no sé. Pero, pero le pregunto. WhatsApp, en WhatsApp, sí, porque no creo que algún grupo tenga la pregunta. Profe, nos can you send the uh, all the questions? I mean, because we don't know which one was. I mean, and, and we know that we have the eight one, but we don't know what the eight one said. So, can you send it, please? Yes. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Camila, ¿con quién estás en la actividad esta? Con Paula. Mm. ¿Y qué hicieron? Un video y el juego si sí toca hacerlo porque pues lo hicimos, así que pues toca hacerlo. Es un oh. juego que se parece a Kahoot, pero creo que oh, es que okay, en quizás. Ah, sí, sí, sí. no le llegó el mensaje al profe. ¿No? no, no sé entonces de qué discutimos. Esas preguntas Karen, ¿tú viste el... cuál era la pregunta? No, no, no vi. <risa> es que nadie vi la pregunta. Yo no alcancé a leer. No, yo tampoco. Y cuando leí no tenía ni idea de esas preguntas. So, uh, don't know. Pues esperemos a que nos una otra vez a toda la, a la otra reunión. Todo <ríe> esto va a quedar gra grabado. Mm -hmm. <ríe> Eso me estoy dando cuenta, pero no estoy diciendo nada. No. Ok. Chicos. <laughs> This states that a learner responses most easily given in the direction of the situation. Listo. Which one? Entonces, is? Is... ¿Cuál es? This Ahí. states okay. that a learner responses most easily given in the direction of the Small easily given. Uh, 
don't know. La vi. Mentiras, no sé. This states that a learned response is most easily given in the direction in which it was formed. No, no idea. I don't have any idea of this. In the direction in which it was formed. I think that he has an association, no? So, what do you think, Camila? Because <laughs> when you associate, it's like you search things from your past and how you were growth. So that's my theory. I don't know. Because refutar is not that. I mean, my col my chichombiano me dice que refutability is como refutar. No? Carolina. Estaba hablando sola. Estaba hablando sola. Sí, me di cuenta. <risa> <risa> Parsimony. Eh... Uh, dice que is a principle that says that the best explanation is the one that requires so it's not mm -hmm. be uh -huh. Par que es parsimony it's a principle according to which an explanation of a thing or event is made with the fewest possible assumptions Como as, as, asumir, es algo de asumir. Um, es como asumir. Oh. Entonces, no sé. Polarity. Polarity, espérate, vos como. O sea, a mí me suena el de association, pero si ya leíste y, te, y dices que no es eso, pues no. No, sí, yo estaba leyendo el de Parsimony, que es de as, 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 asumir. Y el de Polarity. Uh -huh. Ok. Me sale algo como espiritual. El de Polarity es the principle that everything has to pose. Good. And ¿Has to qué? Two poles, polos. What's that? Good and evil. Ah, okay. Ah, okay, you. Those are the two poles. Love and hate. Did you see me sigo yendo con association? Karen, what do you think? Yes, I think that is B. Okay. So, how much time are we supposed to be in here? I don't know. I. Okay, yeah. oosh. Everybody's coming back to the main screen, the main room. I know some groups made decisions. It was the first activity of group, but it's a matter of being attentive. <laughs> Camila and the rest of you. People are touching. Now we're back in the rest of the class. Going to show the questions again, just in case the people need it. Take a picture of the picture or something. This is kind of optional. As you can see, this is not a percentage of the grades, but it can help you a lot, group cooperation. So somebody needs the question, I am showing you one by one, six, seven, eight, and nine, and then we continue. We will lay it. So here we have six, Ducklin's life, 
el patico, el patito. Number seven. Group number two. You have to talk about Docklin also, about Docklin. Take the information for number six. I repeat, six here. Mm -hmm. It's charging, it's charging. But let me know some impressions. Did you speak in the group? Did you make any decision? How was it? You were not, you were not possible to connect? Because if people were arriving late, sorry. But if you were on time listening to the instructions and everything, I present. Group number one. Group number two. Group number three. And group number four. Okay, friends, is it clear with the questions? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. Well, we're going to continue working like 10 more minutes and we stop the recording. But according to the agenda, yeah, we should be working on activities. Silence your microphones, please, Camila or Laura. I don't know who else is there. What is happening at home? Some kid is there. Invite him, invite her to the class. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. So I'm going to check attendance in this moment by asking you to read some of my slides. This information, I expect you use it in your presentations. So, wait a minute. This is the folder. There it is. Mm -hmm. Number two, number three. Okay, yes, just by checking the attendance. Remember, we will finish in 10 minutes, so I expect that when we finish uh, talking about these slides, we can talk about one last example. Maybe ladies, I don't know who else is coming. Okay, maybe. General application. UGC attendance. <clears throat> so, Mao, Carolina, or Isabel, any of you too, please help me reading this, this list. This is the moment that I am checking attendance. The uh, most important theories related to language learning. Uh, first, behaviorist, two, cognitive, three, constructivism, four, Chomsky, universal grammar, five, Schumann, Schumann's acculturation, orientation, and in culture, six, crash and monitor. Okay. Thank you. Uh, next one. Uh, maybe Angie Lorena or Camila Buya, any of you two? Read this aloud, please. No? None uh, of you? Yes. Uh, no, you're, you're not there, but what happens? Uh, teacher, read, yes. Developed, and you, Camila? Quickly, no, yeah, Angie, please. Angie. Developed by Lev Bikoski in 1962, Cutter and Resolder, uh, 20, 20, 0, 4, say that it assumes that language acquisition is influenced by the interaction and number of factors, physical, linguistic, cognitive, and social, as a cited in interactionings. Yes, teacher, you're here. <laughs> I uh, think that he went. I don't know. Okay, the teacher is gone. Maybe have problems to connection. Yeah, I don't see him. Esperemos. 
person. Chicos, no se suponía que teníamos que compartir la, la, la respuesta. I this thing of the, the internet and the two devices. Sorry, well, okay. Uh, friends, do me a favor. Isa, can you hear me? Um, yes. Make me host, as my host, por favor, para que les pueda compartir la última parte que es como la de la próxima clase. The rest of the class, I will stay like in personal feedback with your advances, los que me enviaron. I stay with day and you make me comments about your plan, about your activity. Something similar to what Isabel present, Isabel and Carolina presented today. If but please, Isa, make me host, make me host so I can show you because at the moment I cannot share any screen. Participantes, Oscar Pulido y Aleito, me haces host. Okay, yes. Host me, thank you. Mm -hmm. Uh, teacher Paula, Paula yeah. was saying that she does not have connection, so yeah, that's it. Just for you to know. Yeah, no problem. Yes, I, this is teacher common, for, I know for the rest for, for the rest of for the, the presentation. Rest of the, wait a minute, in this moment, what we need to do? Number one is people help me saying and checking the attendance. I'm going to say your names, please. You have to put the name in the chat. Es que no está sirviendo la aplicación de la universidad. Lo va a tomar así. Put your full name, yes, in the chat. And I take a picture of that. Please, this is the attendance. This is the attendance moment. Okay, only one person. So the attendance goes only to Clay Dermenko. Ah, okay. I'm going to take the picture in one minute and I give you the instruction for next class. The rest of the presentation is for next class. As you could see the agenda at the beginning of the class, we have one more week for the presentation. So next Tuesday, we have two things. One, as many presentations, maybe five or six. The important is that you send me an idea that I see now what you're doing. And we have from 10 to 11, we have one hour for the quiz online, for the test online. You have to check the contents of the weeks, but I'm going to uh, tell you what pages that you need to read for the test. I'm going to show you right now the text, que es the bot, you know, is in the bibliography. Es que no puedo abrir el virtual, si no lo muestro. Ahí está. Que es the bot? And page, let me see, let me see, let me see what page. So you can see, take a photo of the photo. De las preguntas del trabajo en grupo. El que estaba atento sabe que estaba hablando. Me va a entregar en algún momento su respuesta. Pero eso es obligatorio, eso le, le va a dar algunos punticos en el quiz. Eso no es, en cuenta no está ahí en las instancias de evaluación. Share content. Ya les comparto el documento. ¿Qué es de voz? ¿Qué es de bot? Sorry. The online test is about... Wait. Can you see the material? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yeah. You will have to read. Yes. Page. I'm going to show you in a second. 80. Maybe something. Remember, there is always this problem with the PDF and the and the original books. 
wait a minute, because it's In which we, we can find this material? In the last month, in the last week, in case, you know, it's in the 8th or 9th, I'm not sure. Okay. But you will have to read only one. No. Ochenta. Oof. something. Mental is busco la página. Questions? So we can stop the recording in some seconds. Ah, it's coming. It's coming. No, no questions from the rest of you about your activities. Lizette had a question. Lizette, come on. Me? <laughs> no. <laughs> Everybody, can you see me? No. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Yes. 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 Okay. Everybody. This is another activity, but this is the third moment of evaluation. I repeat, number one, vents down. Number two, your teaching activity. Ahí, por ejemplo, Isabel, ya salió esa nota ahorita, se la doy. El resto me va en el avance y lo que presenté es el teaching activity. Number three, online test about this. You have to read this, okay? So, it's one page, 77, en el PDF, pero en el, en el PDF parece es, dice acá, no lo veo, es que no lo estragué, pero es diferente, en el libro 77, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, and 82. And to here. Okay? Sure, what is the title of the, the topic? Wait a minute. I'm going to put the message from 83. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven pages that you have to read. Developments in teaching approaches. This is an agreement. Everybody will read this section of the book and I'm going to ask you questions about this material. It's like a review in history of our class. Behaviorist, cognitivism, constructivism, examples, yes? Pay attention to the task. No tienen que responder todos los tasks, pero si los van respondiendo, yo puedo sacar de algunas preguntas de esos tasks. So you see, it's like a review, a historical review of the theories. Seven pages, you finish in 83, you finish here. Ese es roll of four, eso no lo lean, por favor. Ok, friends, clear for everybody the homework? Yes, teacher. So this is the homework, and I am staying. For the, for the rest of the class, I am staying with people who are interested in the feedback. I'm going to stay with people who want to participate, but the attendance, in this moment, I'm going to check it, take my pictures, so I can read. Now we have in the chat. Wait a minute. Picture of the picture. Más rápido con la aplicación, pero no, les digo que está caído todo de la universidad. Lo importante es que por ahora no tienen que subir nada urgente en Moodle. Yes or no? So, Laura Jimena, Laura Milena, Angie Lorena, Karen Alejandra, Jessica Natalia, Lizette Lorena, Juan Felipe, Carlos Andres, Mara Camila, Mara Camila, at two times, mm -hmm. Janice, Clayder, Stefania, Luisa Fernanda, Monica, Isabel, Camila, Carolina, 17, 18, 19 people. Okay, I'm taking the pictures. Thank you so much. Y esto se ha reflejado en el sistema. Mejor dicho, al final del semestre hay las fallas ahí. Talk to the people who have problems of connectivity. Send me an email. Explain the situation. So we can negotiate on that. Okie dokie. Any other? Yes. In my teaching activity, I don't know if you see that I put like some symbols. And you can touch and it has some notes. Did you see it? Mm -hmm. Okay. We can see it in this moment one to see if it works here, so you can present in next class or what to do with this. Okay. We are finishing the recording in, in like in two minutes, so the rest of the time we can be working on your feedback. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What happened with the 
And I have and another question, but it's something apart from the class. Um, yes, I have to do an interview to a teacher. Uh, could you help me with that, please? Uh, just a second. Uh, okay. If it is like five minutes, yes, maybe. But after the recording, of course. Yes, don't worry. I can uh, send you the questions by email. There are only six questions. Thank you, teacher. Should yeah, okay. I have a question? Yeah, yeah. I have a question, but it's different to currently class. It's about a problem that I am having in this moment. Can you give me a moment at the end of yes. the class? We are going to record. We are going to finish the recording in one minute to say goodbye. And then I stay with those people like particular questions or at the end of the class, like private information or something. Okay, class, please open your microphone. Somebody, you have it? Just read it for me, okay? Somebody, somebody, we finish with this. One minute. Listen to me. Students are impulsive and guided by their in unconscious mind. They probably fantasize about their moms. To be honest, they don't even know why they, have, they behave the way they do. Okay, this is Mr. Sigmund from talking to do you know who he is somebody knows who he is no Freud? Sigmund Freud? Freud? <laughs> yeah this one yes the first one yeah. Sigmund Freud yeah. but the other one no well no worry no <laughs> this is the answer I mean the answer of the conversation Another volunteer. Thank you, Maria Camila. You read it. And another one. one of the Me? Yes, one of the guys. Okay, Clayder. Noun says fraud students are intrinsically good and want to improve themselves. They do it consciously. By the way, but first, we need to make sure their basic needs are met. Very good. Wait a minute. In the reading, in the material that I gave you as homework, you will find someone that speaks about the basic needs. So you will know who this guy is. I will, I will start next class with the same chat, with this example of chat. Imagine this is like a WhatsApp or a Facebook. And we will know, okay, Sigmund Freud, you will understand his role in education, but not really from psychology perspective, psychoanalysis. And this one, I know. I know. Give me the names, and we are about to conclude. Third volunteer to read what this guy said in the chat, in their academic theories of language acquisition theories chat, and her name. Somebody, one volunteer to read this, and you give me the two names, and we finish. Es como la síntesis de lo que van a dar en la lectura que les voy a dar. Hay algunos nombres muy claves. Tell me, tell me, what's his name? I told you. Hmm. Interaction, somebody please. Vygotsky. Yeah, spell it. V I G G O T -K -I. K I. No, Y. Why? Okay. okay. And this lady, the one, yes, the wonder woman of the moment, the woman who spoke about the sens sensitive periods and was focused on pre-elementary and children, kindergarten, what's her name, you know? M.M. Maria? Montessori. No? Maria Montessori.
the internet not working very well. Well, maybe you can stop the recording now, Isabel, or I don't know who else is going to. Uh,